Yeah, hello everybody. Hi. Hi guys. Today I'm, I'm going to play Mario today. Super Mario for today. Just right there. Kirby the Rainbow Curse. How funny is that? Guess what? I just so the reason I'm playing this game now. An avid Chuckle CMW viewer may remember a long time ago I played Oh, you don't even need a nunchuck for this game, right? Um a long time Chuckle CMW viewer may remember that you I actually streamed this game. Well, I tried to stream this game. Like, it was over a year ago. It was like a year, probably a couple months ago. Um, because I, this game's awesome. But my disc was scratched, so I um it didn't really work. But I just thought I should do it again because like the um why is it like that? Why don't I just make a new new file for it? How about that? Um, as you can tell by like the thousands of playthroughs on this game, for both, I actually really like the new Super Mario Bros. series. Okay, yeah, I know. I wanted to play it b again because I know that it's, the era of new Super Mario Brothers is kind of on the way out. Unfortunately, it's kind of going away with New Super Mario's Wonder. Not really, unfortunately. It's good riddance more so, but. I, deep down, deep down, I kind of love the series. I'd say, um, like, you know, oh, they use the Koopa Links in every game, except for DS. Oh, wow, you know, eight worlds, grass world, desert world, beach world, snow world, jungle world, mountain world, sky world, castle world, right? But I honestly... So what? It's so fun. <laughs> and I it's really something where the gameplay, it shows off Nintendo's focus on gameplay. Because the gameplay is so fun in these games. It's literally that simple. You just go left, left. You start left, you go right. But it's still so fun. Other games, no other game really can pull it off and do it as well as Nintendo can, if you ask me. I, and maybe like Rayman's pretty good, but Rayman does other stuff, you know? Nintendo doesn't really change it that much with Mario. You still go left to right. Even in Mario Wonder, that's all you do. You go left to right. Now, I'm not saying that's a bad thing by any means. Any stretch of the imagination. No way. But, oh, well, it's kind of a bad thing. <laughs> it kind of is a bad thing. But it's still fun. It's just that uh, Mario Wonder is going to be great because I think it's going to introduce, like, a breath of fresh air. Something. But that's also kind of why I like Luigi U a lot. I think Luigi U is probably maybe my favorite of the new Super Mario Bros. games. Well, one, I like Luigi a lot. But two, if you haven't seen before. But I'm sure you probably know. But check that out. 100 seconds. That's like the whole cool thing about Luigi U. Hi, Nabbit. But, uh, wow, my controller. I swear my controller is bad. I know. Isn't that so cool, Nabbit? You're like the Alamar badge from Pikmin 3 Deluxe. So cool, right? It's pretty great. I like it a lot. Uh, okay, that's a little bit better. The controls are not exactly like Mar- Guys, I swear I'm good at- oh my God. I swear I'm, I'm good at- Maybe I should play with the gamepad. What if I did that? What if I tried to play with the gamepad? Do you think I'd do better? Should I try that out? Let me try that out. Because I also have a Wii Classic Controller. The one that's like an SNES. Maybe I'd do better with that, too. I'm just kind of finding an excuse. Um... Let me try the classic controller. I don't even know if it supports it, but let's see. Now, but I got this game. Um, this game, I got the disc resurfaced. Like, I don't know if you can hear me. You said you said you uh can't listen, but <laughs> um, okay. Oh, I have to go to change controller. Of course. Oh, that's it. That's all I can do. Okay, guess I can't. <laughs> um, let me try the gamepad. Maybe I'll do better on gamepad. You know? Who knows? Okay. So, let's see. I hate using the gamepad because it's big and fat and kind of annoying. Um, but, let's see. Okay, that's a lot better. It feels more like Mario Maker. Which is what I like more. 
But yeah, pretty much, this game's great. Oh, I want that star coin, actually. See, there's only 100 seconds, but of course they adjust the levels. Also, if you played Mario U before this game, because this game did come out like a year later, for the year of Luigi, um, you might be especially noticing that Luigi's physics are a little bit different, as always, for Luigi's uh, tradition. I need to get a nut for that. Come back. All right, I think there'll be another Waddle Wing, right? Somewhere? Maybe not. Well, see, this is where this is where it gets fun because now I'm like, oh, I don't have that much time. Now I do because the game's not very hard. But for a for a 2D Mario game with new in the title, it's pretty hard. I'll say that. I think that's pretty cool. Um, again, it's not you know particularly challenging. I kind of sat around and like, scratched my butt for a while, but I still am definitely getting all three star coins. No, I'm not. I'm, if I don't get this, I'm... Yay, look at that. Okay, see, I did not do that well. <laughs> I got all three star coins, but kind of barely. It took me a second. And the level size, they get longer, and so that 100 seconds gets a little bit more challenging as time goes on. I'm going to try to, like, beat the game as fast as I can. I'm pretty sure there's a shortcut in this level that takes you to the water world. Or, actually, you do, like, one water-themed level, and then you go to a not water world. That's just a coin. Okay. If, I think I want, like, a fire flower or something. But I just think it's really cool. This game is pretty great. It's got a fun little thing going on. It's just like a new Super Mario Bros. game, but just a little different. And I think that's pretty great. It's also got the fun power-ups from Wii, like the penguin suit, you know, stuff like that. Shit, I uh, shouldn't have killed that Koopa. Oh, it's not dead. All right. Okay. See, there we go, guys. Look at that. This game's great. So great. I think that, um, so, you know, looking at back in the Mario, the thing, this game was originally, or technically Mario U, was originally going to be called... It was a launch title for the Wii U. Apparently, it was being worked on for like four years, but I kind of do doubt that. I won't lie. Um, but they say it was being worked on for a while. I'm missing a star coin. You know what? I'm just going to try this right now. Right, so you can't do that. Okay. Wait, one of the star coins is... That's crazy. So a star coin... Maybe this game doesn't have secret exits, like... Um... Alright, hold on. Where could that first one be? Here. That's where I thought it was, okay. That's crazy that they would do that. <laughs> that is... That's not very Mario of the game, actually, I would say. Because who is going to check there in their right mind? If you if I didn't know there was a thing there... You know, I probably wouldn't... Well, maybe I would have, but I probably wouldn't have checked. So that's pretty crazy to me. If you... If you want my humble opinion, I think that's pretty messed up. I think that I kind of don't like... Not... I don't hate it. But, um... So you can do this in this game, just like you can in Super Mario World and in Mario Maker. But you can't bounce on, like, piranha plants and stuff. But they made it so you can in Mario Maker, so I don't understand why. Also, I didn't get that star coin. Even though I did, but I didn't. Also, I guess that they just don't have secret endings in this level. Because it seems like that's what that other pipe was. So I guess there aren't secret endings in this game? Huh. Well, that's fun, I guess. Alright, next up is Boom Boom's uh, Tower. Um. Uh-oh. Bowser. All right, guys, I'll, I'll be right there at Peach. Don't worry. That's bad news, guys. Let me be sure to get this acorn suit. See, I think that this game, it gets a really bad rap. But I would be lying if I said this game was not fun. All right, I want the, the star. Okay. Do you know where the star is, Nabbit? I know where the star is. Is it here? Ooh, is it here? Maybe. Is it here? No, it's here. See, I'm actually... 
Oh wait, you can keep going until you get the Bowser, right? Shoot, I forgot that. Just kidding. I'm so genius. Yep, that's me. I'm Luigi from the game. That game. Also, I would be remiss not to mention that this game was the first game to feature, well, actually, it wasn't, but it was the first game where you could play as Nabbit, first and only. I think you can play as him in you Deluxe or something, but that, like, barely counts. Um, but you can play as him in Mario Golf Toadstool Tour. Pretty cool, right? So, um, that's pretty cool. They added a new Cole character. I think that's pretty neat. Cannot deny. Ooh, this is the Ice Flower. Um, type a 1 in chat if you are Nicktube right now, because... Get it? Because he likes the Ice Flower. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> there goes the Ice Flower. Um, but you yeah, know, it, it's, it's fun power-up. I actually like it a lot because it makes you think, do I want to have to freeze these enemies or, or die? Uh, die, because this game isn't actually very good, I don't think. Baby Yoshi's in this game. Do you see guys see Baby Yoshi? They didn't have Baby Yoshi in Wii, I'm just saying. Or DS, or 2. Clearly this game is pretty good. Just saying. But like, honestly, um... The game, okay, like Scott the Waz... Now, yeah, I know you don't watch a lot of Scott the Waz. But he made a video where he, he talks about all the new Super Mario Bros. games. And I think he's got a good opinion on them, that they're still fun. <laughs> like, they're not bad games, really. And they're still fun. Now, they're not all, you know, uniquely crafted genius, like, masterpieces. I'm pretty sure that, like, when you go to the Toad house, or, like, when Toad gets his stuff stolen by Nabbit and you have to catch him and Mario you, like, I'm pretty sure that Toad doesn't have a realistic panic attack or whatever everyone wants, wants him to have for it to be considered a masterpiece, but even still, pretty good game. I can't deny. That's where it is. Okay. So they really want you to... Do they want you to jump on... No way. There's no way they want you to do that. But I'm going to see if there's another way to get in there. I don't think there is. I think that they really want you to... Wow, that's really cool, but it's crazy. These towers are hard. Okay. Juan, this game... Probably the hardest new Super Mario Bros. game. I'm just saying. I mean, I don't know if that's a lot to, to go by, but... Hey, it's pretty... You know, that's pretty... That's it's harder than than New Super Mario Bros. U. I I did too just now. I just got all three star coins, and I'm about to do the quick quick the quick kill strat on Boom Boom. Check this out. He does this. Okay, now this is his final move. Prepare for this one. Whoa. Okay, that was um. That, that saves frames if you get hit. If you get hit, it saves frames. Speedrun strat, you, I don't think you would understand, but, you know, I would. But it's pretty cool, you know. See, I'm pretty... I, you know, that's me. Hi, Plush, by the way. Hi, Bob the Destroyer 204. I know that you're Joe, by the way, but I don't feel like banning you right now, but I will later, I think. <gasps> yes, please! Yes, I want to hop on Mi Miiverse right now. Oh, I guess I can. Also, sometimes the game will just give you a free acorn or something, which is pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, these are literally dig leg strats. That's true, actually. It's true. This is rolling Yoshi Hills. Pretty sure Yoshi lives here. Baby Yoshi lives to the right. Trust me, guys. Type a one in the chat if you're hyped for Baby Yoshi. I sure am. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Um. See, I'm I am so like I'm beyond hyped for Baby Yoshi. Did you guys know that the pink Yoshi is actually able to inflate himself like a balloon and help you reach new heights? I think that's super cool that he can do that. <gasps> this is real Yoshi. He's not really I don't like him as much, but he's sort of cool. So he can eat fruit in this game, which is sort of cool, maybe. There's a little secret up here, by the way. You can go in here. I thought you could go in here the other way. I think it's like a secret ending or something in normal Mario Bros. U. 
without Luigi, but... Okay, he's gone. Sorry. <laughs> I don't think he would have died or anything. I think I think I could have lived that. I don't think he, like... Well, it, it happened. Had to happen, so... Do you guys see this right here? This is a little elusive trick. See if you can spot every one. Did you, you guys see Luigi to the left of me? Pretty crazy. I see it, Luigi to the left of me. I missed... Oh, no, I didn't miss a star coin. Thank God. Let's go. This is, like, the best Mario game probably ever. I think... Do you guys think Luigi is... Do you think that he kills people? Oh. Yeah, I do have a war cry. I want to post this to Miiverse. What? <laughs> wow, that's so sad. No, that's so true. He gets out of the out of the painting and then he laughs at him. And he's like, "Oh, oh ha, ha, ha. Oh, oh." He actually that's so true. I think he is evil. If anything, to be honest, I could see that as more reason to say that he's evil than the whole Mario Tennis um, stepping on the shoe thing. The Mario Power Tennis thing. That Matt Pat for some reason, actually used. Now, I think that's ridiculous. Like, but he... D I mean, Matt, this is like a classic Matt Pat thing. Like, whoa there, Baby Yoshi, don't go too far. So this guy's pretty cool. He can uh, do that. I think it's awesome. And you can keep doing it, and then... Eventually, he can't do it anymore, but... Whoa! Alright. Okay. Yeah, he's... Also, I don't know if you guys hear that, but yeah, that's Baby Yoshi singing in my Mario level, which is, like, really awesome. And I like it very much. So cool. Hear it? Like, look at that. That's awesome. Like... Now there's nothing. Look at him. He dances, too. See, Golden Yoshi, who lights up dark areas, could never do that. This is why Baby Yoshi is awesome. I think Bubble Yoshi's my favorite, to be honest. No, <laughs> that's so true. He does not. <gasps> um, can we get a one in the chat if you're feeling awesome today? Dare I say retro? Yeah, that's awesome. This is like the best game probably, like, maybe ever made. You can't not hate this game. I mean, really, you cannot not hate, you can't hate this game. People will, people will try to, but look at this. Whoa, hey there, pal. Oh, he's waiting for me, thank God. I was scared for a second. But yeah, that's right, Baby Yoshi comes with me, because he's, yeah, okay, good. I, I wasn't sure for a second if he didn't, because I know normal Yoshi does not. Unfortunate. But, hey, that's okay. All right, Baby Yoshi, you want to come with? I don't think he likes... I don't think they go to castle levels like in Super Mario World or Ghost Houses because they get scared, but we can go to Piranha Plant's abode. He'll be good at this one. Um, He also can still eat enemies, I think, right? I'm pretty sure he can. Yeah, he can. Um, Whoa. See, even a hammer brother. Okay, he's no match for me, but he ate a hammer too. I'll find your hidden Luigi. And your star coin, too. Oh, is there a mini mushroom this level? Mario. Oh, yeah, he's made of... Uh, there he is! I found him for you! Eat him. Because do they not eat hammer bros? Are they too big? Whoa! Hey, hey! <gasps> okay. That's really bad. I'll... Guys, in World 2, you can find Golden Yoshi. Golden Baby Yoshi. He can light up dark areas. I think that's so cool. Please. Please don't unsub, guys. Um, There will be more. I swear. Can I... How do I get... I need to get up there. There we go. See, this game is pretty great. Like, you know, I just met Yoshi... Or, I mean, uh... <laughs> I just found Grass Hedge Luigi. So, so what? I think that's pretty, pretty great. <laughs> Unsubbing ain't enough. Unmod me. Whoa. Sorry, guys. Won't happen again. 
It will. Um, but not to a pink Yoshi, probably not. I don't think I will find another pink Yoshi for a while. This is one-up cannon world. Uh, fun little minigame. You gotta collect as many one-ups as you can. So, got the gold. The, okay, I got a Bowser, but that's only one. You can get catch as many of the, okay. All right, it's two Bowsers, one one-up. But if you c to collect the coins, you can make it one-up too. That's another, all right, another Bowser. Oh, hey, there's two, okay. One-ups, <laughs> one-up, okay, Bowser. Bowser, fuck. <laughs> Whoa, I got one-ups, I got two one-ups at the end. All right, let's go. No. I was close, though. Next time I can get it, though. I think we're, we're good, though. Hey, yeah, no, I'm pretty good at Mario. Uh, anyways, this is Lemmy's O. Okay. Up next, after this Piranha Plant fight. Mario or Sonic? Easiest choice of my life. Plush, don't input in this question. Easy, Mario. Could not, like... You couldn't pay me to say Sonic. Except for maybe Three Knuckles. That one seems pretty good. And I like Mania. And Sonic 2 is pretty good. But the rest of them are all bad. And Sonic Adventure 2, I like that one. And I kind of like the day levels in Sonic Unleashed. But that Sonic's bad, though. So don't, don't listen to anything I just said. There's the propeller suit. Those are cool because they're not, like, in the levels. I'm pretty sure what they did in this game was they made it so propeller suit and penguin suit, like, you couldn't get them. Um from anything but like a toad house or something like that. So, pretty cool. Also, I like this this level a lot. It's fun and dark. If the dark levels gave you as much like room and like freedom, like the night ghost houses in Mario Maker, I think that you can make a lot of better levels and people wouldn't just like hate it for, oh, no reason, but whatever. Any, where's the star coins at? Oh, there's one. I think I meant to, I was meant to have a uh, nut suit, maybe. How about I get one of those? Mario or Winston Churchill? You know, at the end of um, a level in Mario 64, Mario goes like, -da 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 -bow. And he does like the Winston Churchill sign. So honestly, Mario, because he can do the same thing that Winston Churchill does. Winston Churchill does the sign and like, you know, maybe other stuff, but I don't think the other stuff's really as important. And I don't know, Mario's pretty cool. I like playing Mario, so. Yeah, that's gonna be an easy Mario for me. Uh, oh no. Whatever. Come on, okay. I don't know how I'm gonna supposed to get that, really. You have Nabbit, Mario, or friends and family. Now, Joe, you can answer this question yourself, okay? Think about this for a second. Okay, what am I doing right now? Am I with friends and family, or am I playing Super Mario? Neither, I'm playing Super Luigi U, but I, I would accept Mario as an answer. You are Joe. I know that you're Joey. It, it, I don't know if you know this, Joe, but it, it says for streamers. Like, it, it's literally telling me that, like, it, it knows that you are Joe. <laughs> Mario or World History Teacher? Sorry, Mario's out now. It's all about my boy. My boy. I hope, like... Do you know when we get our schedules for next year? I know we can't have him, but he, there's a chance he moves up to do Gov. Or not Gov, uh, A push. That would be worth it. Wow. Hi, Joe. Who is Joe? I don't know. I, I've been heard. I've heard a couple names before, but I'm not really sure. I think you might be confusing him with some another 12 year old alien. Nabbit. I think you're close, but I don't think Joe sounds like Mickey Mouse. He sounds like... <laughs> he sounds like the Tower of the Gods. That's who he sounds like. Oh, come on! How? Alright. That's a shame. Because I'm sure that would have probably given me an acorn suit. But I don't think I can get the... Uh... Well... That's not gonna... 
I don't think that would have helped me get the star coin, so. Unfortunate. But I get a mushroom. And do you see that? Yup, that's Luigi. Type a one in the chat if you're Luigi right now. Am I right, chat? Yeah, but I wouldn't want to use that. That would be kind of cheating. One, it, it would be kind of cheating to use something like that. Admit it. Blue toad or yellow toad? A la gold or buck and berry? One lives, one dies. Yeah, I'm not playing Pokemon. It's a whole different game. Hi, Lemmy. So this is Lemmy Koopa. Um, he's like three years old or something, and I, I think he eats crayons. But he's a formidable foe. Kind of. Um, I don't know. I think that this is definitely one thing. Some of the bosses in this game are cool. Some of them aren't really that good. But, um, like, Roy is cool. Roy is the next one. Roy is great. But, I think, you know, I'm not trying to name names. But, um, wink, wink, some people, you know who I'm saying, need to give that guy some, some respect. I agree. Very good to a streamer. Yeah? Hi. All right. Good night. Um, you need to come up soon. All right. Uh -oh. I'm, yeah. And then turn off I always do. I know, but okay. All right. Minutes, good night. Yeah. Agree though. Send my guy some love. He's basically the next Abney, pretty much. You see the new summoning salt on Abney, by the way. Very good. And like, you know, strange. There's a summoning salt for a you know dead game. A game that's more dead than Subway Surfers, apparently. Apparently. Okay. Guys, Glow Yoshi is just beyond... Just within reach. So, fret not. This is a Fishy Boopkins. See what this enemy is named? Pretty cool enemy. That would have been cool to say, like... Five years ago, I think. Um, I don't know where the other, I don't know which of the two is the, uh, oh, hey, do you guys see that? That's Luigi, by the way. See Luigi? He's a fossil in this game. Pretty cool. Okay, um, I want to get that star coin, so I'm going to have to. Come on. No. It's unfortunate. Here, I'm fine. I can actually still get that, I think. I just need to, uh, kill this guy. That's doable. That's so doable, actually. Here. I just need to go like this. This. There we go. See? I only need a P-switch. Look at that. Okay. I just gotta, you know, uh, finish off here. There we go, guys. Because it's bad. Actually, it's not good or bad, it's mid. It is not the default one. You have a new one. You're an Alamar badge. You know, I was I was blown away too, Juan. You wouldn't expect something like this during the year of Luigi, nonetheless. Oh, that's Nab- wait, you kill Nabbit in this game? Oh, I guess you do. Because when I f usually play this game, I play with my neighbor. And he would always play as Nabbit, because he was bad at video games. So, not me, of course. Okay, well, this is fun. I could introduce you guys to Nabbit without the 66. Awesome character, though. Um, he, like, has a, there's a remix. It's called, like, Nabbit Steam Remix in, um, m like, some random Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games theme. And it's actually really good. I recommend that song. Very good. Also, did you know that all of the levels in the, or the, all the worlds in this game are named after food? Because it's you, Nabbit. This is Acorn Plains, Layer Cake Desert. So cool, right? This is Nabbit. This is like such a fun thing. It's in Mario U2, but um, the levels are shorter in this game, so you have less time to catch up with him. Which is kind of fun. 
And maybe you can die. Maybe. Yep. I see... I, I've been catching your ass in 1-1. One -one. You're not in the car, bud. You're in Acorn Hill Lane. Sorry, bud. But you thought you were slick. That's fine, though. Okay. <laughs> He's gonna get away. He's gonna get away with all the stuff in the Toad's house. Because I'm... Because I'm dying right now. Okay, how about I... Am I really gonna... I don't, need, I don't need that. That's so subhuman. I do not need that right now. I can, um... Alright, check this out. I'm gonna get one from Waddle Wing, and then I'll catch up to you. I'll be fine. When you're good, you're good. Alright, not that Waddle Wing. I'll get the next one. <laughs> God. These guys are... Wait, no, 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 it doesn't count. Today is, you know what today is? It's a Monday. Any deaths to a Waddle Wing do not count. They're pretty much beavers. And we call that a win, GG. Navit zero, Chuckles three. Well, when you're good, you're good. What can I say? I'm going to get a super mushroom today. Okay, I don't care about either of those, but I will like a I'll go with I'll go with the superstar. How about that? What's up, ghetto gamer? Don't do that though, please. I don't like that sound effect very much. I was just not paying attention. I think it's this one. And I think it's this one too. That was close. I got one of them. That's pretty good. Me when I see the red hat man, that guy's actually named Mario. You might not know this, but it's true. This is Mario. So real. So real, Ghetto Gamer. How are you doing, by the way, Ghetto Gamer? Gaming? Did, did Ian and Antoine ever kick you out? Guess not. Uh, that's Underground Grolls. Piranhas in the Dark. I think this is the Yoshi level. Type a 1 in the chat if you're hyped for golden, shiny Yoshi. There's a... Eight, one in one in four thousand ninety two chance to find this shiny Yoshi. That's with the sh with the shiny charm. No, that's a mushroom. But I think he's in this level later. Somewhere. No, maybe not. Well, he will be next if he's not in this one. But I'm pretty sure he is. Don't worry, guys. Dude, that's that's crazy. What? Well, that's cool and all, but I have golden glowing Yoshi. He can eat... Oh my god, he can't eat Hammer Bros. Or Fire Bros. either. But he can eat the Fireballs. He almost died there. <laughs> but you know he didn't, though. So that's fine. Alright. I didn't get one. I hope it's just at the end. Right? Oh my god, okay. Can I get that, though? Let me show you how a real man gets stinged. Okay, how I... Um... <laughs> I, so I literally jumped there. I don't, okay. Alright, Yoshi's getting in the way. I jumped. I jumped there. I jumped there. No, 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 no. I can do this. I have time. I have, like, ten seconds. Okay, no star coin, guys. Sorry. Sorry, no star coin for today. No! Oh, he's fine. I, I keep thinking he's gone. He went inside without me. No, he didn't. He's scaring me. I, I thought the first time he ran away from me, I thought he was gone. Guess not. Uh, streamer, if you'd please get better at the Super Mario game, it'd be much appreciated. Thank you very much. Where'd Baby Yoshi go? Why'd he die? Oh, he died because he's golden. Golden Yoshi's die. Right. Okay, that's fine. Guys, don't worry. In World 3, or uh, World 4, technically, Frosted Glacier, you can find a blue Yoshi and he eats bubbles or something. Wow. Okay, good start. This is Groll World. The Grolls, you know. Not boys, Grolls. 
they're like thwomps, but they roll. Yeah, babies play this game. Okay, I played. I play. I played this game when I was a baby too. It's okay. I. I was probably better when I was younger too. Not gonna lie. I don't think I would have died to that gruel there. That's okay though. I don't need a mushroom or anything. I'm just gonna kind of move. Oh yeah, pokies turn into like oranges in this game or something. That I don't know. I don't know how that. It's fine. But um. They turn into oranges in this game for some reason. I guess because everything's like kind of loosely food related. <gasps> oh my god, that bitch is back. I'm getting that guy. I see he thought. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready this time. I'm looking at you, Navit. I'm ready. See, it might be a Monday, but I don't need to like rely on some arbitrary clause like Monday beaver claws. I'm going to rely on made up stuff like that to catch a win because he's right there. I just need to, if I get the, the, the suit, okay, I'm not going to go back for that one, but, but that's fine. I'll get the next one. That, um, that one that was right there. I was going to get that one. I'll, it's fine though. We're, we're good. We're chilling. I was going to get that one anyways, but it's okay. See, it's fine guys. I'll, um, I'll make sure to get this first one. See if you ground pound it, then you don't bounce off of it, and you can you can actually kill the waddle wing just like that. That was pretty clean, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. In fact, Navit actually slows down when he's far away from you because babies play this game and they need to make it so they can win. Someone like me, who's always like right on his tail, you know, that wouldn't happen, but they wanted to feel, make you feel good or something. I don't know. Um, that's fine though. I win this, I think. Hey, pal. Looking nervous. Ha! You were saying, viewer. I'll take my prize. I'm not going to use that because it's cheating, though. So that's cheating. I won't use that. But I have it now. Yeah, I probably did too, Cologne. But when I was still, I don't, still don't care. That's still cheating or something. Oh, I should get Baby Yoshi. Nah, I can't. I'll get Baby Yoshi soon, though, guys. Don't worry. But no, it's so cool. It's um, Acorn Flames. Layer Cake Desert. See how it's like a, a cake? Right. Um, Frosted Glacier. Sparkling Waters, I think. We will see, Nabbit. 66. Uh, sparkling Waters. It's like Soda Pop jungle or something and then um rock candy mines that's a classic um it's like meringue clouds i think and then there's peach's castle with a really cool little remix of uh peach's castle from mario 64 inside the castle walls so cool right this game rules that's technically a Mario Bros. U thing, but... Now, I think it would have been kind of cool if, like, in this game, maybe it was, like, Daisy. But that wouldn't make sense, because Daisy's from Sarasaland. I don't know, everyone always complains about that when they talk about this game, like, a missed opportunity, but, like... Luigi's still a hero, he would still save Peach, it's not like Mario only saves Pe Peach because, like, he likes her. So, I think that's kind of dumb. I did know that. I did. It's so cool. It says, like, crown or something. Did you guys know that Nutty Noon is N because, um, it's evil or something, I think? Maybe? Fun fact. Okay. I know. It's so cool, right? Like, that's a, a unique idea. You can't say that's not a unique idea. But it is. I think this game definitely could use some more... What if this game made Luigi gay? Hotel Mario actually did that, so... Uh, you know. I'm just saying, like, it, it's true. Gay Luigi. I hope she made lots of spaghetti. Okay, am I fine here? Yeah, I'm fine here. This is a good level. 
you know, a, a bad game like Super Mario Wonder would never have something along these lines. Oh yeah, they're, they're putting chemicals in the water. They'll turn to frogs. <gasps> Is that Luigi? Can we get a one in the chat for a little Luigi up there? Right there, you guys see that? That was Luigi. Uh-oh, I didn't get the star coin. Oopsie. They're putting chemicals in World 4. <laughs> Turn my Luigi gay. Don't send the two. Don't send the two. Next time, I'm going to be faster. Alright, and... Little 8-bit Luigi will be mine, okay? Yeah, but I'm, I'm not liking your tude today. It's, like, uncool. I thought we were Mario Bros. Tomorrow. Maybe. But I guess you're... Nabbit, bros. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Alright. Here's where my parkour really shines. I did well in this part last time. Bam. Bam, bam, bam. What if Luigi eats mushrooms? And goes to that... Oh my god. <laughs> that one oil painting level that everybody loves. No, that's true. That's a cool level. But oh my god, how could a person go one stream or YouTube video without mentioning that random video? Because everybody likes it so dearly. But that is so funny. <laughs> I, I forgot I didn't mention that. There's this one level in uh, the jungle world. Like halfway through jungle land, you go like... Like you beat Boom Boom in like snake block world. And then you go to this... um. Hello, little stylus. Hello, little stylus. Hello, Mario. Hey, Boom Boom. I call this my spin blade. Yeah. Okay. Like, I, I will defend this game a lot more than a normal person probably would. But the bosses kind of suck. Like, most of them do. I, I still like this, uh... I think it's Morton. Not Roy. I don't know. They're like the same. Right? Can I see from here? No. I think it's Roy. Oh, nope. That's just... It's becoming evil now. This is also cool. See, people hate this game. She's gonna... Kamek's gonna make, like, poisonous cloud around it. While it becomes World 8. See, that, isn't that awesome? It's because Boom 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 is meant to be played by an actual baby. But, um, you know, that's cool, though. <laughs> okay. Um. I'll fight this fire, bro. Okay, or not. <laughs> that worked out. See, I think that they're wrong. I think it's honestly a good game. Yeah, there are many new Super Mario Bros. games. If, the, if, okay, if this game had the bosses of New Super Mario Bros. DS, and Wii, actually, I would say Wii is the worst one. I have the best memories of Wii, but it's the worst. This is the Baby Yoshi Challenge. Um, type a one on the ch on, in the chat if you're hyped for Baby Yoshi Challenge. So you have to get one of each. So, uh, let's get, I'm going to get the Ice Flower. Into the two one. I'm just gonna keep my eye, my fingers on each. I already lost track. I think I know where the two one is though. Never mind. Okay, this game's hard. Oh, you can just get them in whenever. I'm stupid. All right. Take this one. All right. Well, I'm just gonna have to guess now. Uh, that one. And I guess I'll get this one, too. Oh, come on, bud. No. This has got to be good. Okay. <laughs> I got the one that you can't get. That's what I've generally heard. That's the consensus. That's, like, usually what people say. I've not played two. It's still... I'm going to be honest, it still looks like a fun time, but I have not played it, so I, I'm not sure. I can't say, but 
it looks fun. I mean, it's like it's a new Super Mario Bros. game. Again, like it's still fun because it's Mario Bros. And these games also definitely shine when played with friends. Um, I think that's to be honest, like the whole entire niche that we has. I, like when I think of we, I think of multiplayer. I don't think of anything else. You or Luigi, you I guess. I I don't necessarily associate that with like. You know, you have to be with other people, even though that's what I usually, how I usually would play these games. Like with my neighbors or my friends or whatever. But, um, I still think that, like, this is still a perfectly fine game by yourself. I, oh, why'd I jump? Darn. His name is Reznar, bro. But you're so great, though. He's a million times better. Um... No, yeah, but, like, I I just think that Wii is a little bit, like, undercooked. It, uh, doesn't do a lot of special stuff, I don't think. It's got, I mean, it, it really isn't much different from this game. I just think, like, maybe the level design in this game's better or something. I don't know. Drybone has convinced me that this game is, like, the best new Super Mario Bros. game. And I've barely spoken to Dry Bones, but he has said that to me, so. He really likes this game, I don't know why. Well, not in this game. He hates Luigi U, I think, but he likes Mario U. I don't know why, but he really likes that one. Good choice, though, I like that game, too. Oh, Lamar Luigi! Oh, I got distracted. When I see him, my, my heart starts thumping, and I got distracted. My bad, guys. Won't happen again. Nintendo Land. I actually haven't played Nintendo Land, but that game, um, I want to play Pikmin Adventure really bad. That game looks fun. So, I need to, I need to get it sometime. It's like $5, because everyone has it, but I mine didn't, so I got my Wii U in like 2013, I think. Um, with this game, actually, because it was like, the, I got like a Luigi Wii U. <laughs> I mean, it, it's not green or anything, but, um, it's like, it was, like, part of the Luigi event for the year of Luigi. And it's green, so... Okay, goddammit. I'm gonna be honest. 2013 was such an amazing year for games. I think that they peaked in 2013. Where do I begin? First of all, this game is pretty great. It's not perfect, but it's a really good game. And I would, not, I would be totally lying if I said this game was bad. Well, it was a good game for Nintendo. Um... Other games, Mario and Luigi Dream Team, totally great game. That's like the shining star of uh, the year of Luigi. Also, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, another good game. Uh, Dr. Luigi, who doesn't love Dr. Luigi, am I right? I like that game, I think, maybe. Um, <laughs> uh, there's also... Like Animal Crossing New Leaf. God damn it. How do I die there? I'm not going to be a continue gamer. I'm not going to be like... I'm not going to... I'm not going to go and continue mode. Let's be real. Okay, bud. I'm not. You have the Luigi... No way. That's so cool. But yeah, if you guys weren't here at the very start, I have a... Like the package. It's like Luigi U and... Mario Bros. U. I actually was considering buying Luigi U separately because they had it at the game store not long ago. My uh, my retro game store I go to. They had like just Luigi U and I wanted to buy it because it was like $5 <laughs> and it also has like really cool green box art. Like that's awesome. How could I not buy that? I, I really think I should have. But um, also the, the best game of 2013 would be Pikmin 3, definitely. That was like a actually really good game. Um. It's pretty cool, though. That's so true. Dream Team... Pr it, it, I, I want to say it's my favorite Mario and Luigi game, but it's not. But it's really, really good. And I say it's my favorite because it's my it's the sleeper pick. Because it's no one ever talks about it that much. Everybody says Bowser's Inside Story is the best. And you know what? They're right. It is the best. The Walls of Eyes... Dude, this guy is called a stone eye. Uh, they're like in the background 
in Mario Maker, but you can't place them. But I still think that they're kind of cool, so. Pretty cool, right? Anyways, oh, there are beavers in this level. Damn it. That's fine. I didn't get hit by any of them, so. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh oh. They're actually called Stone Eyes. Google it, bud. That's like the name of them in Mario. Pow. Dream? Okay. I couldn't, like, okay. Like, Cacletta, like, the okay, at the very end, that's really, really hard for no reason. I don't know why. Um, Evil Bowser <laughs> is also pretty hard. I have not beaten or played Partners in Time. Oops. But, um, the final boss of Dream Team is actually also pretty hard, but they do a good job at keeping it hard, huh? <laughs> Sorry guys, my uh, Wi-Fi cut out. That was weird. Okay. Wrong level, what? Wait, do I have to play the levels again? I I do. What? Wow. Yeah, the one that's like bow bow wow now wow now wow. Yeah, that's from this game. <laughs> Oops. All right, I got a one up on purpose. There we go. Just uh, you know. I might need it, maybe. Whoa, that's pretty mean, Cologne. Please don't say that ever. Thanks. Alright. This level, easy level. I don't know why I died. <laughs> well, I didn't die to this level. I died to the other one, but... It won't happen again, I swear, guys. I'm sorry. Whoa! I didn't miss the one up, right? Or the star coin? Nah, it's over here. Yeah, no, no. We're fine. We're so fine. So fine. Where is that? Why okay? So they move together. Sorry. I didn't know that. I was thinking of a different one. I don't need baby Yoshi. I was thinking about that, but... No, no, no. This level's easy. You can go really fast. I don't need to turn on Spring Breeze mode. I do not need to turn that mode on. You know, maybe sometime when I play Yoshi's Woolly World on a stream, which will actually probably be soon, I will not be using Mellow mode. Yep, that's right. Now, do not try this at home, because I know some of you, you kids, little punk, I'm sure you need to use Mellow mode in Yoshi's Woolly World with all the badges and, like, the watermelon badge and the badge that gets you out of pits. Probably noobs, but, you know, I'm not, so I just thought that no hard feelings. Don't feel like you're, you know, lesser because you have to use mellow mode and fire watermelon mode. But, you know. Turn on assist mode. Hold on, guys. I gotta turn on boost mode so I can place blocks under myself to catch myself from a fall. I think this is a good idea. You know, actually, the thing is, Poochie doesn't really help all the time. In certain levels, like, he just kind of can't do anything. But I would always use him because I think he's cute. But, like, he's not always that good. I would usually just, like, not use badges. I usually didn't use badges, but when I did use badges, it was the one that makes all of your uh, yarn balls really big. That one's pretty cool. I like that one a lot. Because it doesn't, like, interfere with the gameplay too much, but it's, like, fun. Like, if I were to replay it, that's the one I would probably use. One of them. It's good. I like the watermelon sometimes, but not always. It's cool, though. <sighs> that's no fuzzies, Phoebe. 
I must avoid these shiny, yet deadly coins. Hooray. No, I need the coins because I'm gonna game over. <laughs> I need to get 10 more for one up. We're fine, guys, don't worry. But yeah, look at me, I'm pretty good at getting coins. It's gotta count for something. Do you guys see this? This stone eye actually looks like Luigi. This is because that he has a mustache and a nose, and a, it says L on his head. This Lakitu? Do you guys say Lakitu or Lakitu? That's a good question. I say Lakitu, but I don't really know if that's right. Fun question for you guys. I don't think I need to. Actually, I can reach him now. Eh, he's gone. Whoa, why were there no star coins in this level? What happened to those? Well, I guess I'm not getting them. That's fine. I'm probably not going to play like World 9, so I don't need them. Sorry, guys. Sorry, World 9 fans. Lack E2. Lack E2. Lack E2. Lack E2. Late. Lack I2. Lack I2? Because that's the way you did. Not lack E2. Lack it. You mean like lack I2? Alright. I don't like this level. That's a creepy name. The walls have eyes. I'm going to fight Morton today. This is a cool boss, actually. He has like a hammer and he hits the uh this pokey at you. It's a fun one. I like Morton. Not as much as I like Roy or Larry, but you know, he's cool though. Alright, give me that ice fl all right. That's great. <laughs> Ah, okay. I can get it next time, though. I will collect all red coins next time. That's fine. See, this level... It's clear to me that Nintendo's game design has really... plummeted. Okay, alright. I'm gonna have to ask Little Brother to hand me the controller in a couple more rounds, because he's, he's really losing a lot. I don't really know why he's, he's very bad at Mario games, but that's something that's always been a problem with his. Okay. That's, see, why is that, why does that go in the lava too? I don't think, I don't think that's necessary to happen. If I'm, <gasps> Nabbit, where's he going? Oh, that level's easy. I can catch him in this one. See, there actually aren't waddle wings in this one. Turn on Mario mode? No thanks. I know what you mean, but I think you need to beat the game first. Also, um, the games were like, like the level was like designed for Luigi. So if you play as Mario, it, or like with Mario physics, it kind of sucks. Usually. Most, it kind of does. All right, stay, stay right there, bud. Why am I, I'm not even gonna use the, the nut suit, the evil one. It's fine. All right, now it's stay right there, but <laughs> come on, there we go. That's fast. Go low. Yeah, it's over for you now. Whoa, he has secret blocks. Got him. Wow, you're really you don't run quite like you used to, bud. I could. That's a sad thing that I, I really could. I would totally benefit from it. I kind of need it, but that's okay. I don't need it. I don't need it, need it. I just really, really need it. Or I would use it a lot. That's what I'm saying. No, he won't. You see... Oh, by the way, I'm using the D-pad. You guys use D-pads or circle pads. Or joysticks, whatever they're called. On the 3DS, it's called a circle pad. God damn it! That's what I get for drinking water at the start of my level. 
hold B when you select this level. Okay. Cool. Welcome to Morton's Lava Block. All right. Thanks, Nabbit. I think you were thinking of a different but <laughs> Because nothing happened. Ugh. There we go. Ice Flower, please. Thank you very much. That's much better. See, now with my newfound ice ability, I can freeze dry bones instead of dying to them. And now... Yeah. Whoa, okay, then. That, that, see, that's not fair. Yeah, I'm on gamepad right now. All right, ZR. Don't catch a cold. The mushroom is poisonous, isn't it? Alrighty. See, look at that, guys. And you all said... You all said I was bad at Mario and stuff. Well, hey, Drybones, what do you think of that? He killed all of them for you. That's what he thought. Okay, so that's a little tech called... <laughs> I'm rushing. I'm rushing these levels a little bit too much. I think that's the problem. But if, if you go a little slower, it's not a big deal. ZL. I forgot to try. <laughs> okay. Hold. I'm not using a continue again. I'm not doing it again. That's not happening. Sorry. It's not. There's no world where I'm going to use another. Hi, Frosted Venom. I'm not... <laughs> I'm about to that game over. <laughs> Not, not happening to Mario, L Luigi U of all games. Okay, come on. <laughs> yeah, you were in the showdown stream, right? Okay, oh my god. <laughs> oh, all right then. You know, that's, it says two continues. That's not true. I didn't continue last time. My Wi-Fi went out, remember? Oh. This is my first real one. I'll hold down both. What? I have to, oh, I have to go to both. Oh my god, I'm really bad today. What is wrong with me? Well, all right. You know what? I'm going to use power-ups because they're useful. Oh. Screw it. And I'll even go to this toad house. I'll even do that guys. I'll sink to that level. If I keep losing, I'm going to have to pull out Yoshi's Woolly World. Or Kirby and the Rainbow Curse, actually. You guys want to vote? I will I will abide by the vote. Rainbow Curse or Woolly World? I, I could do both. Thankfully, both of those games are easier than this. So. I can actually beat those games, I think. Hooray. Ice flower. What's up, Nick Tube Nation? Hooray! Okay. Um. Now this level's easy. I could. I really do not. This level's like super short. I don't need any power up for this one. Also, the athletic theme in this game is pretty good. I like this one a lot. I guess I've heard it a lot, probably from like Mario Maker. But I definitely think it's, like, actually pretty good. And no one talks about it. What an underrated tune. Huh, guys? The, um, what was the Wii one again? I would totally remember if I heard it. Oh, it's one that's like... Remember, this, this game is bonus theme. You know... Bonus, not required to beat the game. That kind of bonus. I did not need to go for that star coin. What was the point of that? <laughs> it's fine. I'm fine for lives, guys. This game is just very easy for me.
Siege. Okay, that hit the, the stone spike that he was going to throw. It's fine. I'm fine. Just focus. Wow. Okay, I should have spinned there, maybe. I'm trying to go too fast. See, that's my problem. I'm not going to stop, though. It's more fun, but I'm I'm going to keep doing that. But I will make it to uh, beach land if it's the last thing I do. It's time to jump on some baddies. There we go. Oh my god. What is wrong with me? All right, one more death and I'm going to Kirby. Kirby and the Rainbow Curse. I'll beat like Wispy Woods or something and then the stream will end. But that's all I have to do. That game is easier than this. Oh my God, I was just not paying attention. Okay, I'm not trying to lose even. If I, nab it. If I lose, which I'm probably going to, if I, if I get another game over, I'm switching games. Do I go Wooly World? Holy shit, that does not count. That doesn't... Fuck it, that counts. Okay. Wooly World or Rainbow Curse? Type a, a 1 for Wooly World, a 2 for Rainbow Curse, guys. Or else. ZRZL? Okay. I'm doing both. Oh. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's the strat. Yeah, that's a good idea, actually. That's... I can beat the game now. Yeah, that's smart, actually. That's actually... That's a good idea. Yeah. Wow, this is really easy. Whoa. Wow. Thank you so much. I needed that. I didn't even I really didn't know you could do that actually. And I I pride myself on knowing stuff about like games like this. Wow. Fun fact, Nabbit, thanks. I needed that too. I've already beaten this level, but you know. That's fine. Now I just need to... Oh, Luigi. Hello, Luigi. I also like... Oh, he just feels better to control. Wow. I won! He can also eat power-ups. Like, he'll eat them. He puts them in his bag, but like I think he eats them, though. He's cool because you don't take damage. I like that. I think that's very cool. That he does not take damage. Hello, Boom Boom. Hello. I already fought this guy. Maybe I'll stay in Luigi mode then. Or not Luigi mode, but I'll keep playing this game. Oh, he can get knocked back. But it does nothing, but he can get knocked back, so that's cool. Hooray! Wow, that's... Awesome, I think. Does this mean that, like, Nabbit won't steal from me anymore? Because that's also cool. Oh, and I get to be Nabbit just... Never mind, so he will still steal from me. Okay. Yep. That's awesome. Thanks, Nabbit. Okay. Wait, they have bruisers in this game? Okay, that makes sense. That's actually crazy. I didn't even know they had Bruiser in this game. I'm going to be Luigi for this one because I fought this one almost like a million times. If I don't win, I'm going to be mad. And like, I can't. And I can win it in like five seconds too. It's like a quick level. That was... I'm, I'm doing Nabbit. I need to do Nabbit. 
World 2 gets hard, guys. I swear, it seriously does. It, it's hard once you get... There's like a big difficulty spike or something. I'm serious. This game's tough. Okay, that little spike ball gets me. But you know, it's fine though. I'm pretty good at this game or something, so. Wow, we call that a Nabbit win. Yep, thank you very much. Now the game is playable. Much better. Much better. What a cool character. They don't you can't play as this guy in Mario U. Just saying. Mario U wishes. It wishes all right. If only. Oh, I'm not Nabbit either. I really want to be Nabbit in this level too. Damn it, that sucks. Okay. I can do this one too. This one's not hard. This this is world two. <laughs> this is desert. Jesus Christ! This is desert world. Well, yeah, in U Deluxe, but like not. I'm assuming not on this one. Probably. This is the uh, the double thingy. Um, like it's the bundle deal, but I don't think I really don't think you could do it for this one. That would make no sense because then people would talk about it. But I've somehow never heard about the fact that you can. Whoa. Okay, I've somehow never heard about the fact that you can do that. That's so cool. All right, I think that you can like go down here. But there isn't a star coin? Where are they then? Alright, maybe you can go down here. No, you definitely can't. You can't. Where is the star coin then? I don't need the star coin. But I kind of want it though. Well, whatever, it doesn't matter. Okay, I'm gonna play Kirby, I think. Right? Mm, yeah, I'm just gonna. Mm, yeah, I'm just, uh, mm, yeah, mm, yeah, I'm gonna play Kirby for a little bit. I think this will be fun. I like Kirby. Nabbit would have won. Nabbit would not have died there. That's true. I keep forgetting to do it. No, no, no. Not Spring Breeze mode. I do this myself. I'm pro. Yeah, that's me. Yeah. I'm pretty good at. Uh, this game, I think, so. You know me. Kirby or Wooly World? I think it's, we're, I think we're doing Kirby, right? Let's, let's do Kirby. I haven't played this game in a while. I also got this game resurfaced, so it might not work. Because this game, um... Its disc is messed up more than Mario. Last I checked. We'll see <laughs> if it's still bad, but I think it is. So... This game's so great, though. Everyone does. This game's so great, actually. Like, Glacia is in this game. <laughs> I remember I saw this one playthrough of this game when I was younger. I think it was like, we like to play, or like this group of like four guys. It was awesome or something. Anyway, um, this is like my one file. Let me show off the stuff that's in this game that you wouldn't automatically unlock. I don't even have everything. I have most of it, but not all of it. Look, this song is called Beware the um, Forest Fungus. It's a reference. Yeah, this game's cool like that. This is Superstars, yeah. Bubbly clouds? Don't mind if I do. Kirby 64 is leaving the factory. Ba-ba-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-bum-
Do 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 do. Bum 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 bum. They, this is a really good remix. Probably my favorite in this game. I gotta turn the audio up a little bit. Also, there's a Mass Attack remix. Pretty cool. Oh, of course. Crown, pretty great. Can't deny. Um, I really like this song. So cool, am I right? Yeah, this game's great. Check out my figurines. Another awesome part of this game. I don't have that many of them, but like shop shows in this game. Um, I think that's super cool. <laughs> Like, look at that. I don't have a lot of them, actually. I have some of them. I have the Clayken. That's cool, I think. <laughs> and yep, I have Dark Crafter. Yep, that's right, guys. He's real, and he's a 3D model that you get to play with. I feel like some apple pie. That game's so great. This mysterious being to control. Awesome game, can I just say? Best game ever, I might have to say. Alright, I remember I, I started this file on stream, that's why it's at 1%. I started this one on stream, and then it didn't work, so... I, or I guess I won't erase, because I did nothing in it. I think I played, like, the first level, and then it stopped working. Like, the tutorial. Pretty much. Nope, not even. <laughs> but both of you guys know how the game starts, so... It's, um... Yup, that was Dark Crafter. Oh yeah, also you get the, uh, the whole diary thing. There's so much in this game. It's actually, like... People really say this is the worst Kirby game, by the way. Sorry, you're kidding. If you say that, you're joking. I don't understand why people would say that. When, like, this game is this good. Sorry, it's this good. It's the best game. This game is actually just so great. Now, but after you're done with Woolly World, totally play this game again, too. It's so good. Like, so yeah. You get to draw with the gamepad like, a path for Kirby. People complained about it. It's not that bad, guys. It's pretty fun. It's in like just like in Canvas Curse. It's basically a sequel to Canvas Curse. But, um, better, maybe? Well, most people disagree with that, but I think it's probably better. It's a good game. I like this game. Yep, that's right. Kirby lives here. And there's like a combo meter or something. Pretty cool. And like... I mean, I can't not love this game, sorry, it's just... It's- everything's made of clay. It's so cute. It's great. Like, I used to play this game with my friends. He got to play his bandana D because I was nice. Would let him have fun. It's still fun, though. Oh, damn, right. I think you told me that. That's... wow. That's unfortunate. How does it not work? Like, what happened to him? Because it could be something, like, possibly fixable, you think? Uh-oh. That's fine, I'll fucking find I'm so glad it's not, like, filled on me yet. Last time I streamed this game, it, it stopped working, like, right around here. <laughs> But that also, to be fair, I also was able to do the intro cutscene and stuff, so. I don't know. 
Did this game come out in 2015? 2015? Alright. That year was not as bad as people say, I'm gonna be real. It wasn't, like, great or anything for Nintendo. But, really? It has two great games in Mario Maker and this. Yeah, this game's great. Also, I think Woolly World was, like, the same year, I'm pretty sure. Maybe, maybe they were, like, a year apart, but they were both, like, I would say top five games on the Wii U. Okay, that? Nah, but I had the same problem with my Wii U gamepad. I don't remember what I did, but, um, it was like that for a while, but then I was, like, super bored, so I got it fixed. Just, like, by fiddling around with it and looking at tutorials on YouTube for a while. I think that... I think that is fixable, because playing this game again, it's great. Great game. Uh-oh. Am I good here? Yeah, I'm fine. This game's so cool. Oh, here's, like, the evil zone. You can't draw here. It's, like, cool or something. I want to get all the other chests. I don't think I found all of them. But this game is full of collectibles. No, no, no. That's, like, actually... I don't like all the hate the Wii U gets. I've said this in like every single stream I've ever done. But the Wii U had good games. I have a GameCube, and I'm sitting there like, wow, what games do I even get for this? After Pikmin, like, I already have Wind Waker. I already have Metroid Prime. Like, because they got ported. So it's Pikmin, by the way. Every single good ga game on the, on the, win on the, oh my god. On the Wind Waker. Every single good game on the, uh, oops. If I didn't get the diary. Um, but like, did you know guys know that Kirby lore is actually very dark? Oh my gosh. Also, yeah, um, Haltman president guy, when he, what are we going to get guys? I want to get Kirby. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay. Who do you think this is going to be? I think it's going to be that little like clay guy that's everywhere. No way! Wow. That's awesome. Oh, you're right. There are two. <laughs> One of them actually real world money. I I mean both of those actually I guess apply, huh? I unfortunately don't think that I will unlock Dark Crafter for some time. Up the big old tree. Kirby is in this game. Pretty cool. Why is the song of this in this game like awesome too, by the way? He climbs a tree in this one, I think. This, this level's like a reference to um that one Kirby level. You know. Pretty cool. This game is full of This game is the best. Wait, 2015? Nah, Robobot was 2014? Maybe Robobot was 2015. This game was not 2015. This game was like 2014. But I still think 2015 was great, because if Robobot was 2015, that's another reason to like it. I don't think there was any good Pokemon games 2015. Sun and Moon were like 2016, I think. 2017? Nah, they were not 2017. That was Let's Go. Or, no, Let's Go is... I don't know. Let's Go is not 2017, this is 2018. Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon were... Whatever, 20, 2017 or something, I don't know. Did you get the chance? Yeah, that's, um... I, I, I have, I totally have the chance. I, I think I'll have to, that's a good idea. If I can possibly get it for a little bit of, like, a sale or something, maybe I will. Because I'd love to stream that game. And yeah, I haven't played the original Return of Dreamland before, but um, it looks really fun and stuff, so I'd love to give it a try sometime. And, you know, like, I, I was waiting on my retro game store, having Return of Dreamland. I was like, oh, they'll just have the Wii one for like 20 bucks but it was actually like closer to 40 so i was like all right i'm not gonna 
like, get that just to not have all the new features. Hello, evil shots, though. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah. This game has it, so. Alright, I think I'm supposed to go super mode here. I'll let Kirby bounce off there. Yeah. Up, up, up. There we go. And look, I already have it back. Yeah, you can get combo stuff, and then you get the super mode. This is what happens most of the time. It's really, like, bounce into random stuff. But. Still great. Uh, can I just, like, how do I get in here, even? Ah. See, I have not played this game in a good while, but. And I, I remember some small things. Not much. I remember you fight Wispy Woods in this game, you fight the Clayton, you fight that one guy. Because <laughs> I only, I mean, you can see from the, uh, the, uh, list of my files, like, those are all my files for this game. I have one that I didn't even 100%, but I did most of the stuff. I beat Dark Crafter and stuff, so. Um, but I didn't, like, not much more than that. Oh shoot, I should set the title to not Ouija U, probably. Uh-oh. Um... Can I get that? Please. The controls? Okay. They're not bad. <laughs> they're not bad. I don't think they're perfect, but... It's a very unique idea. I would probably be having more fun if I was just playing a Kirby game. I'm gonna be real. But, you know what? That said, it's still fun. I don't care. Wow, that was a challenging foe. Fight fearsome foes. Yeah, that's- it literally is. <laughs> that- that would explain why, like, when I was- like, my friend enjoyed the game more than I did. He would come over and like, hey, can we play Kirby? I was like, I don't know, I want to play Woolly World or something. Or whatever other game. But, because you got to play as Bandana D. That actually makes sense. It's still, you know, kinda cool to be Kirby, I guess. It's still fun. I don't have a stylus either. I don't doubt that makes much of a difference, but... Maybe a little difference. Yeah! I'm missing a treasure chest. Uh -oh. Hope I can get it. Dun, 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 good song. This game has some, some good music. And I don't remember most of it. Most of the songs from this game that I remember, with like some exceptions, like the theme when you're um in the rocket and you're like fighting the guy. That song's really good. But um Most of the songs that I remember well from this game aren't even like actually from this game, they're just like remixes. Like the Moonlight Capital One, or the, uh, or Crown, I guess. But, uh, pretty cool. I like this. I like it a lot. Also, yeah, this game, much like Woolly World, you know, they are made by different developers. I don't think this is a good feel. Um. Whoa, come on, get that. Please get that. Thank you. But this game, Woolly World was made with a good feel. I don't know if this game was. Epic Yarn was, but I don't think the Epic Yarn people made this game. But if they did. B -b -b bonus room? Oh yeah, guys. It's bonus room. Pinball mode? Pretty cool. I'm bad at it, though. Can I get the superstar? Guess not. Alright, go back up there, please. There we go. That's more like it. Okay, wrong way. <laughs> That's true. 
They have invincibility candy in this game. Did you guys know that? Kirby's also in this game too, I think. All right, now this time I'm gonna get the diary piece because they're cool. All right, come on. Uh oh, I'll get it on the way back. It's fine. <gasps> no. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, it's awesome. What's her name? Elena? It's Elena, right? I was thinking this entire time because I literally forgot her name. But I think it's like Elena or something. It's so true, Kabul is the best. Kabul a surprise? I got a song from Superstar. Alright, that's awesome. Um, now we finally get a diary piece. Eileen. God, I was close. But yeah, every single level has, like, the five treasure chests, which is a lot. And you get that. And you get, like, a lot of cool stuff. I had a Meta Knight amiibo. Actually, I didn't. I gave it to my friend. I don't have it anymore. Because he moved, unfortunately. But you can scan amiibo in this game. And I, they give you cool stuff. Um... I swear you could, like, play as Meta Knight or something like that. Kirby would, like, look like Meta Knight or act like Meta Knight. It's something like that. B whatever. There's something like that. Because I, I remember he came over and we scanned the Meta Knight amiibo one time to see what he would do. It was cool. I have, the, my only amiibo I have that left is Dr. Mario. <laughs> because I, I gave my friend my Mario one... A normal Mario one for his birthday, and I gave him uh, Meta Knight, and I I kept I had a Luigi one, Doctor Mario, and Pikachu, but I lost those two. Don't know where they are now. They're probably I if I had to guess I think I know where they are. But you get masks, so that's what it is. So you don't get the play as them, but you kind of. I actually, I also know that, um, Return of Dreamland Deluxe adds a bunch of fun masks. That's pretty cool, I think. I probably, I think I'll get that game soon. Not, not too soon, because of Pikmin 4. Because I'm going to be playing that game for a while, but, um, maybe after. Maybe, like, closer to that. I was never really t as into Amiibo as most people, but, I don't know. I mean, I was, they, they released it, like, while I was into Skylanders, like, I think, like, every single kid was into Skylanders, and I was like, when, when were Amiibos? 2015? So I was probably, like, 9 or 10. Which is, like, when people are, kids are into Skylanders, so. Here we go. Almost didn't get that. Um. So, like, Oh, they don't have a Dark Crafter mask? Yeah, never mind. I'm not getting that game. Sorry. Ooh, is that a light motif in this song? I feel like I recognize that from somewhere. Oh, shoot. I'll get it on the way back. Yeah, that's a light motif. I heard it. See? It's so cool, dude. This is the best game, like, ever. Oh my gosh. I totally... I gotta... I, oh my god. That's the best. You know what's so cool? See all these fish in the waterfall? Check this out. So cool, right? I don't know why there's a leitmotif from, like, ground, I think, in this one. But that's awesome, though. But I, I mean, it's in Crown. I don't know if it's, like, meant to be, like, a different song from Return to Dreamland or something. But that's totally Crown, right? Yeah, sorry. I hate fish. Especially fish from Kirby. 
They don't even have goggles, so they're like not the real ones. Okay. Super challenge mode room. Yeah, we call that a win. Whoa. Almost not. Look at that, guys. Now this game is more my style. You know what I wish was happening right now? A problem with the game? I wish I was looking at what you guys were looking at, which is my nice screen and my nice TV and not my gross gamepad with fingerprints all over it. <laughs> it still looks nice though. But like, it's, it's kind of an unfortunate part of this game. <laughs> Another reason why it's kind of nice to play is Bandana D. I'll have to I'll have to get a friend over sometime to play this again. Like, and I get to be Bandana D. <laughs> because I would I would be down for that. Uh a little water. Uh oh. Come on. There we go. <laughs> no way. If you hold down Z R and Z L, you will hand me another bag of damn chips. How far up here can you go? Nah, no more. Oh yeah, also, there's like a limit to how much paint you can put out. I don't think I mentioned it. But yeah, you can only do like a certain amount or something. Can I get the combo up? That is so cool. I've never noticed this light motif in this song before. But that is definitely from Crown. I just wonder why it's in this song. Usually a light motif is in there because it's like has like a story relation. Maybe maybe Magalore lives inside of this cave. Do you guys think this is true? I think it might be. Alright, I'm gonna go get that little secret secret room over here. Whatever it is. Oh. Oh no. There we go. I was almost not really ready. I was like falling asleep. I almost didn't get that one. It's not Magalore. Oh my god, it's Dark Crafter. Wait, I I, 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 I misremembered my bad. I still remembered it! It was still Dark Crafter. Okay, that makes sense then. Because it's literally Rainbow Curse. I, I thought it was crowned for a second. <laughs> oh my god. Oops. My fake fan is showing. Eek. Okay. Um, I have all five treasure chests. I think the level's about to end. Though, right? Is this game the best? Man. I think like if the next console they do has a touch screen, it's like not the Switch, it's just, which is just very good. This game would not work on the Switch at all. Because it's so, such a small screen too. But um that would be awesome. Yep. That's called awesome. Why is his theme so cool, too? Because he's so dumb. <laughs> he's stupid, he's made of clay, and he has sunglasses. But his theme is really good. Hello, light motif alert. Ooh, diary time. Hooray! Ooh, gold medal too. Don't mind if I do. Yes, please. All right, guys. What are the guesses? I think there's gonna be one of the fish and like a shot. So I already, I already got a shot. So one. The fish is gonna be one of these. 
Bordo. Bronto Burt. Mass Attack music. Fish Guy. And what is that? Like Dreamland uh, adventure music. That's pretty cool. <gasps> the Forest of Wispy Woods. All right, yeah. Okay. Okay. I want to use my Dr. Mario so bad. Alas. Dr. Mario could pass off as a Kirby character. I'm sure he looks he looks the part. So cool. This music's awesome. You get like chased by vines, right? Yeah, you do. Or not. <laughs> you just put vines there. Oh, you kind of do. Guys, it's literally like... This is an Anubert video, I'm sure. Right? I remember the um the the theme that plays before a boss in Forgotten Land is in it's when you see when you first see Vader. That's great. I definitely remember that one because I associate it more with Vader than I do with Kirby. <laughs> Which is ridiculous. But I do, it's pretty great. Awesome boss. What a good song. Guys, watch out. Wispy Woods will become metal in this game. And he's extra strong when he's metal. Beware. Beware. I think that, like... Kirby, when he gets hit, actually says Poyo, which, like, everybody says... Oh, well, Kirby says Poyo. But he says it, like, never. But he actually does say in this game, I died in Kirby's Rainbow Curse. I died in Kirby's Rainbow Curse. Wow, okay. Oops. That's okay. But, um... Yeah, but, uh... He actually says Poyo in this game, which is kind of crazy, because he, like, never says it. I'm gonna try to get some stars. I'm gonna get like a super dash. Maybe that's a good idea. Right, I'll let the stars form. Boom, okay. I just need two more super stars. And then I get a star dash. All right. One, two. Okay. Now check this out. Okay. <laughs> All right, then. That's cool. That's cool, too. Yeah. Hey, hey, streamer, please don't do that ever again. All right. I won't do that again. Sorry, guys. Um, I will win the battle this time. He's summoning Bronto Bert. I died two times to Wispy Woods in the Rainbow Curse. Oh my god. We're switching to Wooly World after this if I die here. <laughs> That's not happening. That's not happening. I'm not dying here. I'm... Not gonna let that happen. That's crazy. Okay. I'm just gonna get all the stars that I can. Every single one. And then, like, in two more little cycles. And I'm fine. Right, I'm gonna have to miss that one, because I want to be dealing some damage right now. See, we're fine. I, I think if I uh, don't get hit by that, I won't. There we go. Star dash built up. Now check this out. Now this time there's no spike in the way. Oh right, you're supposed to do that. I forgot about that. 
All right, there we go. That is more like it. I channeled my skill. And yeah, I won. I forgot to mention that, like, it's really funny that in this game, the reason that Kirby can't walk is because he was in a ball when he got, like, frozen in time or something. Which doesn't make sense because, like, like, Bandana D was, like, fishing or something. Like, shouldn't he be stuck, like, sitting down all the time fishing? Right? Can I get some game theory on this or something? Dig and Dash. Hello, I'm Dig and Dash guy. Yep, we call that awesome. That's, wow. That's great. <laughs> Kirby's just lazy in this game. Okay, cool. Also, yep, this song is a reference. That's pretty cool. They got Radish Ruins in this game? This is Radish Ruins. I'm not stupid this time. Right? That was Radish Ruins. Actually, that's Magalore's theme. <laughs> this is the theme of the Lore Star Cutter, guys. Star. Oh, I should so stream Starfy actually. That came with rules. That would be fun. And evil little guys with the drills. You guys know what the, the guys with the drills are called? I know what the guys with the drills are called from Super Mario Galaxy 2. Hey guys, is this, um, is this Gourmet Race? Yeah, I love Kirby. Kirby with a gun. Gourmet Race play. <laughs> Lol, I think. Kirby says to leave your post. Ain't he, Digga? I think he is. Alright, cannon time. Guys with cannons. Whoa, check this out. That doesn't work. <laughs> okay. Alright. <laughs> Oops. That's the key from... Uh, I don't know why the keys have ears. I think it's like... I don't know. They're kind of cute, though. Lol. Lol. Lol, he like kills people over strawberry shortcake. Wow. Kirby is evil? Erm, um, what the poyo? Lol. <laughs> that was not PogChamp, I don't think, guys. Type a one in the chat if you want to see some baby Yoshi action. Oh, these guys crush you and kill you, I think. They're like the stone eyes from Mario Bros. U. Yeah, Kirby's totally dark, I swear. It's like, uh, like zero two, like, leaves. I think that's evil and dark and stuff. So dark. Just blood. <laughs> like, a little bit of blood, too. <laughs> But no, it's dark, though. It's true. It's true. We call that dark. Yeah, that's IROC. Uh, I guess you just get all the stars. And the treasure chest. Hooray. Yeah! <laughs> okay. Uh, kill him. Go to the Kirby area. Ah. This is K. 
canon world. Oh, the evil, um... The evil thing is from this level, I forget. Not the, this level. <laughs> it becomes like a water boss or something. Ugh, or a fire boss, I forget. Whatever the boss is, I forget the name already. Oh shoot, I died. I was like, oh, he's gonna break through the, uh... That stuff, but then he didn't, so... Right, but there's a, a checkpoint. <laughs> Oops, dropped it back. I mean, the game... Just as I play it... I do wish I wasn't having to draw stuff right now. I wish I was playing, like, a Kirby game right now. It's still fun. It's just, like... You know... It could be so much more. I would not consider this the worst Kirby game, though. Like, Dreamland 2 or something, probably. I don't know, that game's good, but not that good. Okay. I don't think I have to do this, but I'm going to. Yeah, it is the best game. It's just people say it's not the best game. I think this game kind of rules, to be real. If I were to be real, that's what I would say. I would say that this is the best game. I mean, I would probably put this like my top five Wii U games. Actually, no, I wouldn't, but it would be like up there. I think my top five, my number one is Pikmin 3, my number two, actually, my number one might be Super Mario Maker. Because I, I like, like that game, I guess. Um, and then Pikmin 3 is also really good. Best Pikmin game. It probably is the best. I'll be on God, too, if you want. Um, Pikmin 3 Mario Maker. Mario 3D World is pretty great. And like, I guess Mario Kart 8. I don't want to say Mario Kart 8. Mario, Mario Kart 2 is way better. Mario Kart Wii, I mean. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't... Brain... Brain likes one. Brain thinks one's the best one. But, like, I think one might be the worst one as I replay it. I, I, I used to be of the belief that Pigment 2 was the worst. For the same reasons that Shafrilis says if you've seen his video. Um, but I, I kind of think that maybe one is because the Pikmin are so stupid in that game. And it, it just kind of is annoying. Because they're so dumb and they, they can't like do anything right. Like whenever I fight one enemy, then every Pikmin I have is gone. Really? Pikmin Whoa. Whoa. It's crazy. Um Pikmin 1 was Pikmin 2's engine and two and Pikmin 2's AI and stuff would just be good. It would be it would be great. And probably I would honestly say maybe even like the best Pikmin game. That's how much of a difference it would make. In fact, there's this this mod, or it's a, not really a mod, but it's this thing called Pikmin Squared, Pikmin One Squared, and it's um, it's just that. It's Pikmin One and Pikmin Two's engine, but it's it's literally like. It's the, going to be the best Pikmin game, probably. But I have to play it. Actually, because it's a, a, it's in Pikmin 2's engine, you could play it on GameCube, or a Wii, or, I don't know, a Switch, technically. I'm sad that Radish Ruin... Oh, That Radish Ruins did not play the whole time. 
What a shame. Okay. What do you think they're going to be? I think one of them's going to be a digger. I think one of them's going to be big digger. Let's see. One of them's going to be music. Radish rooms. That's Kirby on a star. That could really be from, like, anything. Hey, right, I don't know. <gasps> that guy? Why does he look like that? Why does his face kind of look like that? I have to wonder. I'm gonna check out the secret diary on my other final. Maybe a city trial. If it's air ride. Isn't there like a, there's like a Checker Knights remix in this game too, I think. How is my Wii, my Wii U gamepad is already low battery. That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> okay, guys, let's check out on my, on my one file. Maybe I'll go back and just 100% this game on this final file I already have. That'd be fun. But they have a details on like every single thing. This is Kirby and food. He eats a hot dog in this game, I think. It's pretty cool. Um, well, I don't even have that stone eye guy in this one. I have Med Knight. Wow. Check out the diary. I haven't seen read the diary in probably so long. Because I have most of these. Every single time I... Okay, I don't. I have most of these. I have some of these. This is like Rick, Kine, and Koo, right? Oh, right. This must be TV. So cool. Okay. Alright, let's we'll check these all out. It's, they're so awesome. I made a friend today. His name's Kirby. This guy's all called Waddle Dee. New buddies are the best. Play just stole the colors. He's a very talented artist and loves colors. This is me. My name's Eileen. I'm so cute and awesome. I like springtime. I'm a painter. Oh yeah, that's like their awesome house or something. They have party room. Secret room. So cool. They live underneath an urn. You can see that right there. Up at the top. That's pretty cool. Right. That's when you transform. So cool, right? Probably winter. It's because she's evil, I think. <laughs> I love this page. <laughs> I forgot about this page. Oh my gosh, this was such a good one. This was like my favorite. This used to be my favorite, probably. I don't have that one. This is like the Clayton or something. He has Galaxia and milk. That's so cool. The Great Escape. He's stronger than Bastron. Here's Rick Kine and Koo. There we go. That's so cool. That's so cool. <laughs> I need to fill out all of these. There's this one we're just on. They have like mini games and stuff. There's like Mr. Bright in this one and Krako. Kawasaki and like awesome alert. There's two of everyone in my secret diary. I wonder if Klaisha and I will be friends again. I have my doubts, but when I'm with Kirby, I can do anything. Awesome. And look at that. That's so cute. That little apple that Kirby was trying to get at the start of the game, remember? Okay. So I'm missing how many of these? Maybe someday I'll come back and stream these and I'll go for all the ones I don't have. I think that'll be fun. It's only like a couple levels. Not too many. Um, what challenge mode? What's, what's this stuff? Wow. I have not done all these. Oh, uh, music room. I'm also am missing a lot of these. The return of color. <gasps> 
Um, yeah, I call this awesome. Okay. Thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, it still said it's Luigi you title in the stream, I think. I'll change that. Okay. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoy Magalore's theme playing right now. So, I'll probably stream this again sometime. And go for, like, 100%. Just on the file I have. The new one, or the old one. Yeah, thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time on the flip side. Craft you on the flip side, suit you there. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye bye.